And we're going to go to Armando Trull, who has more on how this investigation is affecting people who live and work in the area. Armando? Well, this is the aftermath of that brazen shooting that Bruce Johnson described to you. We have police cruisers just like this one at every major intersection between 9th and 13th Street, all along U Street. You can see Ben's Chili Bowl, one of the landmarks of this neighborhood, basically closed down. Nobody can get in and out. This is the heart of Ward 1. And Councilmember Jim Graham cut short his vacation to return. He said the community is sick and tired of the violence. We are absolutely fed up with this madness, which is, which, is, which is present today, but it has been present before. And we need new legal remedies. And I know there are root causes, and I'm the first one to say let's address, address the root causes. But the fact of the matter is that we need new tools to deal with this from the point of view of the criminal law. It might have been speed. And right now you are looking at a live image of U Street. This is not what U Street usually looks like during rush hour, but it is closed down. No word yet on when it will reopen because the overturned vehicle and the other vehicle are still behind me. Police are still processing this very active crime scene. Reporting live from Armando Truel, back to you.